Okay, guys, that's one of you guys said that you like me with my videos, doing my theme song, so we're gonna do my, we're gonna do a theme song that we all made up, all of us. So, here we go. So, we react to everything Disney favor. No matter what it is, duck tailed or horror-related. As long as somebody, as long as it was made by Disney. That, that is what we do to you guys. We react to those ones that you want us to react to. As long as, as long as a Disney, was made by Disney. So deal with it. And don't, and, <clears throat> and don't worry, it, we will be on there soon. So be happy that we will react to it. That is our theme song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Any words from Zolly? Well, good idea. Bye bye. So that's our theme song, guys. Hi, everybody. Martha here. Uh, so today we're doing the first DuckTales adventure season. Three episode sixteen. That's what the episode's called. First adventure. So right now I'm having a little another little throat problem, so I can't really do Donald's voice for a long period of time. Doesn't matter anyway, because this episode Donald's a kid and he hasn't hasn't got his speech impediment or whatever reason he talks like this all the time. Hasn't happened yet. He talks where everybody's able to understand him besides people who know his voice, like me. But they're after an artifact that is basically if you write what you want on it, it happens. It's a paper, so it's basically a genie without all the consequences. So, yeah. Well, there is, I guess, some consequences for the people who get adapted to, but you know what I mean. Um, so, and, so, Bradford, um, is trying to, trying to start his, um, little foul thing, and, um, not, and, and be denial, thought, saying he's not being a bad guy, but he is. So, my favorite parts for this episode were, when Ludwig shows up, because Lu you don't get to see Ludwig that often in, in Disney works, and Disney stuff. So every so time I, I, we, I see him, I treasure the moments of him. Because he is pretty funny. So, definitely showing his um, little clip on here. <laughs> so, and um, he, she goes and talks to um, that cr the crow lady that's a bad guy who has a robot hand. I don't know all these new um, villains' names. So, yeah. And they team up together. And Scrooge gets um, Donald and Della from his sister. So, yep. They babysit well their dad's in the hospital, I guess. And they end up going on the venture going to get that paper. And we had, we did see um, Duckburg... Duckler, um, not dead in this show, in this episode, so yay. <laughs> um, so they go to, they go on a plane, it's basically a little Indiana Jones thing happens here, because remember, um, in Temple Doom, how his pilots abandoned them? Basically the same thing happens here, except for they're not asleep. <laughs> And, um, Della is able to land the ship, so even at, I don't know, 10, she's able to land it, like, that makes any sense. So, and they go after them, and we have what, and Scrooge tells, um, Donald here, he's a free, he's a future free lawyer, which, if you know Donald, he kinda is. <laughs> Like, how does he do all those adventures by himself all, all the time? So, do you ask me? Yeah, 
Screw tape far off. <laughs> and they find the treasure with um, Scourge doing his little pogo thing. And it makes that far back. Wow. <laughs> that far. So, um, they find the little paper. And he finds about, um, about, um, about the buzzard and the crow being about the about the buzzard betraying him, and but he makes sure that he forgets about my writing in the paper that you forget. Um, the crow tried to do that, but I guess since you didn't, he didn't think of them. This is Nick Della as psych Della and Donald as psychics. They're not. They're his family, so. So not they're not gonna end up daring getting disappeared. That's why it didn't work, I guess. For her. And Scrooge made sure only his heirs find it. So and I guess that either means Donald, Della, or the triplets would find it. Since they're his heirs. And I guess Webby, but So yeah, since she since he does consider her his heir is her, his heir, even though they're not related. So, yeah. And they are, and he, and they end up fighting, um, basically Blackbeard version, duck version of duck name, um, Yellow Beak, which is weird. Everybody has a yellow beak. Pick a different name, but okay. And, um, it's Donald has his first outburst, <laughs> so yay! <laughs> and so that's good. He goes wah, 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 for the first time, basically <laughs> as a little kid. <laughs> and um, they end up fighting, and so they end up going back home. Um, Scrooge ends up hiring um Bradford, not knowing that he's a bad guy since. Bradford made sure he forgot, and um, he ends up allowing Donald and Della go on his um, all his future adventures and stuff like that. So yeah, so we get to find out how. So it's basically their origin story. They, I know that um, Ducktales did an origin story before on their. Sh it was like the first episodes, how he ended up. Um, adopting the triplets from Donald, but I don't know. I like both versions. So, yeah. So, I, was, I like this episode. This one was pretty good. Um, the ones that you see clips of, if the if YouTube allows me to, would be my favorite parts. So, I'll see you guys later. Like, clear, subscribe, and let's see if next time I have enough to do it doing Donald's voice for the whole entire episode. Uh, but anyway, since I like multiple parts, it's easier for me to do it this way, probably. I like multiple scenes, so. Bye-bye! Bye-bye!